Oh, I'm about to cut off this mic because I'm going to speak to you guys for a little bit and I'm going to crash because I am tired. Nevertheless, I will be able to. I did a red big reading and the baby ran in here and messed it up and I was at the end of it but it was magnificent i'm sorry guys i hope you guys are all feeling great tonight well this morning um it's like one in the morning or two or something of that nature but i am so tired i know that much um i'm gonna drink me some water and i'm gonna talk to you guys for a little bit and i get sick of people like having their little opinions or whatever you got people that's doing like tons and tons of things on youtube that is some of it is sickening and some of it isn't, and some of it, I mean, it just all depends, whatever. Because um, I'm not asking, like, certain people to come to my channel to give me fuss about what I'm doing, okay? I mean, just let me do me as long as you can't see me, unless I'm in the camera Brushing my teeth to you guys, showing you guys all my gook and my aftermath of residue of toothpaste coming all out. And I don't think people should really be bothered by that. I see a lot of people do like a lot worse. Um, brushing my teeth is not as disgusting because brushing your teeth is not disgusting. You need to brush your teeth. That's practicing hygiene. It's sickening if you don't brush your teeth. Oh, I just like, I I seem like, it doesn't seem like I'm coming to YouTube, like some of you people need to like be at a daycare or something. Hell, Sometimes I can't even get my my speech together, or whatever. Um, get my speech together because I'm not used to like speaking like that or whatever. Speaking like you know to a lot of people and just the sight of me knowing that it's like cerebral. Like more than most of the time, like hundreds or thousands or whatever people visiting my YouTube. Um, and then you got these sick ass people that are YouTubers that will do any damn thing to come up that they would risk the chance of using their energy to literally claim that they're using your stuff, but in a sense, basically, really on the cool, taking it from you. I mean, literally stealing it from you and claiming, oh, be, and then have the nerves to talk trash. And you know that your whole ass live for the devil and that you're going down very soon. Just as well as God used whomever that got all up in the air that's been using their energy to be demonic or whatever and drop that damn corona out in this on the universe to expose people and get them sick and people to die. The devil gonna use them too that's thinking they done got away with your items that think that they rising to the top and that they doing something. Oh, baby, 
they ass going to be at the top so they are miserable. They ain't going to even know if they're going or coming. The majority of them don't know where they're going or coming now. They're still miserable. And then they're the same ones that's trying to give information and insight on relationships. You're going to find out here pretty soon that they're the main ones that's getting probably the fuck beat out of them because their karma is going to be. I'm just going to keep it real. That energy got to come back somehow. You took from somebody. So you're going to get in quite naturally. It's going to be worse. It's going to be 10 times worse. If you've been out here using your energy to think you're being real cute, when that partner come in that you swear that is divine or your soulmate or whatever, it's going to be the devil himself because Satan already been using you to take items from people on YouTube that you know they didn't belong to you, that you know that you didn't ask for, that you know that you had the wrong intentions behind it, that you know that you was trying to stomp on somebody to get somewhere in life. Baby, that's coming back to a whole bunch of y'all right now. And it's coming real quick. So get, wait for it. Wait for it. That you ain't getting no divine partner. You getting a demonic partner that's going to come in with about 10 more demons with him or with her that's going to misuse and abuse and steal and take and take and take. And you, every time I turn around, I end, I came into union. That's what you're going to be saying. Knowing damn well you've been on YouTube. You did everything in your willpower to get over on people, to use people, to steal people. Wasn't no spiritual in you, spiritually demonic. And your ass is going to be in for the ride. So get, get ready for it. I got so many. Oh, we Lord. You know what? I, I can't I can't deal because I'm not gonna I, I I'm not gonna lie about the things that I need to speak about. And I'm not gonna lie on nobody else, and I'm not gonna even lie on my own self. That's why I care not to, you know, just carry the lion train on or carry like once you start doing one thing that's ugly and energetically that's bad and being used by the devil and demons instead of spirit of light, that one thing turned into like a whole bunch of demons that's using you, that's operating inside of you, that's partaking in different little things that you're doing, but you're so spiritually blind Claiming that you're spiritual, but walking spiritual blind, you would know, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to have to wait my turn or I'm going to have to let this be, uh, you know, patience is a virtue. And I see that, you know, my subscribers, but y'all been reaching and grabbing and taking everybody's stuff to speak on and to put out and to use and you're not using it. You're stealing it. And then you get all of these high dollar subscribers that's donating and doing all this stuff and not for one minute you wasn't subscribed to that person's channel that you stole from, that you taken from and you wasn't none of that and I just, it's just like I'm spinning my wheels talking to you people and I just care to not do it no more and I'm talking about it's the whole group of people. Now, people that's really being used by God and by light and this speaking the truth and they trying to get their messages out and they so badly, they want their channels to grow too, but you see them and their channels barely, you know, getting so many subscribers and they're speaking the truth or whatever. It seemed like the devil try to use people of darkness to overbear and overpower the people that's really, really of the light. And the enemy is trying to take the people that's really walking with the light, the enemy is trying to take their light and their shine and their items and their equipment and all types of things, but you can't do that. Your ass is a taker. You're going to get taken and you better hope your ass don't get taken off somewhere. Okay. Off of something off completely off since you want to take, you want to be a taker. Take off 
on your ass or get taken off somewhere or get, you know what I'm saying? It's a thousand ways you can be taken from. So just remember that when it, when you up against that, that, okay, that situation, because God going to make you remember and you're going to be saying, who did I take from and trying to play like you don't remember? You know what the hell you did. You know who you took from. You know who you betrayed. You know who you backstabbed. You know who you uh, stomped on. So let the games begin. You know, I'm, I'm telling you, I've been always, and I keep saying I'm going to leave and keep on saying I'm going to leave. And then, you know, I, I started feeling bad for the people that do ride with me that's really legitimate, that I really could be telling them something that, you know what I'm saying, that's good for them. And, you know, I just don't want to be a person that, I don't want to be a person that really abandoned my freaking legitimate subscribers dealing with all these other demons and other hoes that I'm having to deal with. I don't want to be, you know what I'm saying, just take off on my folks or whatever, because they, if they ride with me and they really are here legitimate and been here with me since, you know, when or whatever, you know, they really ride for me and I be thinking about them because I hate to like leave people like, but like, really, this is getting like over the head and all that. I don't like to be around people that just, that I even just got to watch and I see and I know what you're doing because you're not entitled to my stories. You're not entitled to my giftings. You're not entitled to my lines, my rhymes, what I put out on YouTube. You're not entitled to my shit, devil. So get that understood. You're entitled to pay me for it if you want to just think you're entitled, so entitled to get some shit going and plotting and scheming and lying and jocking people because you want to somehow keep your little green light or red light off and, you know, knowing that you're a big time artist or whatever, whatnot, and you want to act salty and fake and phony and all of that and hide behind this damn YouTube and all of that, knowing that you're being on here, sitting all day long, reaching and grabbing shit to get the bag and run off with it. That's what they do. You know what I'm saying? They ain't here. They get the bag and they go. You know what I'm saying? They get, they getting your, taking your items, using them, coming up with their money and they're jetting off on your ass. And they're not going to look back to hand you nothing. They didn't ran off with your sack and your stack and your rack. <laughs> That's fact. You know what I'm saying? And it's not even funny because I hate it because I hate. You got to be a damn hater to jack somebody. Up. It's basically like you still like we still on the block and niggas hitting licks and we robbing people and shit. That's basically what they doing. But eventually all of this going to come to an end, just like our drug selling, just like us being on the block, just like us using our energy to do all that shit that we was doing, you know, years ago or whatever it played out or you ended up in the pen or, you know, God going to get rid of your ass somehow. The same devil that used you going to end up abusing you to eat, you know what I'm saying, to you, your back is up against the wall and you have nowhere else to run or to get your, this is going to end too. And it's not going to end well because Nevertheless, y'all still basically teaching people how to take and behave in an ugly manner and hate on one another and be envy and jealous and, you know, rob and snatch and take. So basically, you're really not changing. You haven't changed anything about yourself. You're still walking with the devil. OK, and those demons still using you. So that's just another thing that y'all just need to know. Anyway, but I'll talk to y'all in the morning. I'm just supposed to go. I'm gonna, I am got to go drink this water and go lay down. Y'all have a great night. Have a blessed night. God bless. And I hope that God be with you guys and show you guys into the light. In the mighty name of Jesus. Bye.